How's it going, everybody? Uh, if you've never seen me before, I'm Coin Ring Maker, and I thought I'd try something a little new today. Uh, so I make coins into rings, <clears throat> and a lot of times on my lives, people are like, well, how much is everything? So I made a little chart here. Uh, you can get specific state quarters or uh, specific year quarters. We got half dollars uh, in 90% silver and clad. And I've got peace dollars and Morgan dollars you can get a ring made out of. As well as some fine silver rounds. If you guys want to check them out, uh, coinringmaker.com. The link is on my profile. Just tap my logo right here or the gold chain down here by the comments. If anybody has any questions, feel free to put them in the chat. Uh, I am just packing up some orders and giving you guys some time to check out the website. So if we do get an order uh, that comes in on this live, we'll get to work on it. But other than that, I just wanted to uh, see how this whiteboard here would work. What do you guys think? You think it's a good idea? Bad idea? I don't know. Is there something I'm missing on here? Um... And if, if you have any questions, again, just put them in the chat. down a little bit might be easier to read can you guys read this okay i know my handwriting isn't the best but uh hopefully this will answer uh, some questions on pricing uh, if anyone's interested in getting a coin ring let me know uh, if you'd like to see a specific type of ring i can i can uh, show you an example of it uh, but yeah i'm coin ring maker i make coins into rings that's usually what i do on tiktok lives but uh, currently, I don't have any orders. So if you guys want to get something and see, you know, some jewelry made on TikTok Live today, uh, head over to the website, get you something cool. And if I see an order come in or you let me know you've ordered something in the comments, uh, we'll get to work on it. If anybody has any questions, feel free to ask. And if you're going to hang out for a minute, uh, go ahead and tap the screen a couple times. We're currently sitting at one like on this live. I understand there's not a lot of action going on here currently. But one like, guys? Come on. Come on. I bet it was accidental, too. I bet the person who liked it didn't even mean to. They were just like, boop, oops, oh, my bad. Didn't mean to tap the screen there. Uh, we'll go ahead and give you guys a look at some of my work. <clears throat> so, for example, this is a 1890 Morgan dollar that I've made into a ring. It's got some really nice detail to it. I really like these Morgan dollars. These are 90% silver, and they're $200. I also have uh, peace dollars available if the Morgan isn't your style. And here's an example of a half dollar made into a ring. This one has the tail side out. This one's from 1964, so this one's 90% silver. But I do have them available in copper as well if you'd like to get one of those. And uh, one of my more popular kinds of rings would be the uh, quarter. So this is the 2022 quarter. Got a whole new design on the front and the back. And see here you've got In God We Trust all the way on the side of the ring. Liberty across the top and the year right there. Got quarter dollar on the inside. 
and United States of America right there. These are pretty cool. We've got uh, all 50 states in uh, quarters, uh, copper clad and 90% silver. So if you want to get a specific state, say Texas, for example, what's the smallest punch I have? It's itty bitty. Quarter inch. That's the smallest one I've got. I don't think I've ever used this. You see how clean it is? I don't think it's ever been used. I may have used it on a dime once, but it's it's really tiny. Yeah, that's that's the smallest. I also have some um, more unique kind of coin rings. This is a Susan B. Anthony dollar. It also features all of In God We Trust. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. I mean, I could, I could probably try it just for kicks. It'd be a thick ring. But yeah, y'all check out the shop. The link is in my profile. There's also a coupon code. I should put that on here. I don't know, what do you guys think of the whiteboard? Is this, is this a silly idea? It's a good way to get out some quick information. I don't know. I think it's pretty nifty. How's it going, Greg? Hey, I am currently um, just kind of piddling around. I've got a couple things to pack up, so I'm going to do that over here. Uh, if you guys want to check out the website, um, the link is on my profile. There's also a little gold chain down here. Uh, check out my product photos. There's a bunch of different types of coin rings on there. And uh, if someone just decide to order something, we'll get to work on it. And you'll get to see it get made right here on this TikTok Live. So that's pretty cool. There we go. Yep, I sell coin rings. Be making them all the time. Let's see, can we see everything? Not bad, I don't know. Well, if anybody has any questions, feel free to put them in the chat. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and pack up the two orders I've got over here. If I see an order come in, we'll get to work on it. Other than that, I'm just going to kind of let this whiteboard do some work and uh, answer questions for uh, new viewers. If you haven't followed me yet, go ahead and tap that follow button. Uh, if you're going to hang out for a minute, tap the screen a couple times. This is one of the things I'm packing up today. This is a Virginia quarter with a 3D skull and crossbones, kind of uh, Jolly Roger symbol impressed into it. And it's on a keychain. I think these look pretty cool. I'm gonna go ahead and send them two extra Virginia skull and crossbone coins to go with it. I think they'll like that.
get them their own cornringmaker.com sticker here. Pretty cool. And we'll, we'll print off that label and get this sucker in the mail. some cool coins out here if that'll if that'll pique anybody's interest <laughs> nice American Eagle over there I do want to make one of these today just to get a product photo of it. This is a 90% silver, one ounce memento more round. I've done these in copper before, but I think the silver is going to be next level. So if I don't get an order after I finish packing these up, that's what I'll make. What's going on? Dude, I need to talk to you. Okay, I found a way... Uh, to get reviews on individual products on Equid without without spending any money. It's called Helpful Crowd. Uh, if you go to my website right now, you can see that I've got like little uh, five-star like review things on my products now. I think you would dig it. Uh, and that way you don't have to pay for this stupid plugin. I've been meaning to talk to you about it. I just got it yesterday uh, and I really like it. Helpful crowd, that's what it's called. Like, there's a paid plan, but you can use it for free. And, um, it's, it's pretty cool. You got it too? Nice. You're ahead of the curve, man. I can't thank you enough for, for getting me onto Equid. Like, it's so much better than, than relying on Etsy. It's pretty groovy. Dude, my favorite part is that it sent emails to my past customers asking for reviews. Like, it was just like bulk emails like i've already got three reviews i set it up yesterday uh the q a is really nice as well like how it's like ask a question just this little bitty spot but that's gonna save so much trouble i i really like it i'm stoked about it anybody else here gets get excited about new website tools just me <laughs> especially when they're free uh, you can't beat that if I do have any past customers in here, uh, y'all, uh, go leave a review on the product you order. Uh, just go to that product page. There'll be like a, a little button that says leave a review. I would really appreciate it. Get a ton of questions. Oh, I believe it. See, I, I can almost guarantee like 50% of my customer drop-offs are because they have like a simple question. Like, can I do it in this size, or is there something, uh, like, specific I can do to the ring uh, for them, like a different shape or something? So I, I'm really looking forward to, to that. I think that's going to be good. But yeah, after I finish packing up these two orders, I'm going to make this into a ring gonna be cool
yeah, I'm I'm really stoked about it. I I wish Equid would just have reviews like available in, like even in the business package. Like they should be like, okay, you can get reviews now. But no, three hundred for a one ounce ring would justify the price. You can buy a setup for that much. I mean, it's it's uh, labor. Uh, it it took me two and a half years to figure out how to do all this. I'm running a one man business, so I have to pay taxes. Like there's there's a lot of expenses that go into running a business, and yeah, I mean if if I mean I've I've easily spent thousands of dollars on my setup, so like if you can do it for three hundred, more power to you. <laughs> yeah dude it's i uh, i i'm <laughs> it's all on the books like i i'm my account my own accountant you know i i make the stuff i ship the stuff i market the stuff i take the pictures i and there's a lot of work that goes into this guys like i make it look easy but like you're not just paying for the ring like you're paying for a, a bunch of of labor and expertise that, that, uh, you know, happens on the back end. I mean, I, I have no problem like teaching people how to do this either. Like I have tutorials on YouTube. So if you want to do this yourself, uh, I have a recommended tool list on my website. You can check that out. I've got videos showing you how to use each tool and where to get them. Uh, so yeah, I, I'm, I'm not worried about competition. Like if you want to get into it, that's totally cool with me. I think it's, it's pretty cool. Like coin ring making is awesome. Yeah, it's, it's, it's not easy. And I work fast too. Like you, you will get your, your ring handmade in the United States faster than any other coin ring maker out there from me i can almost guarantee it because i do this every day so hopefully that answers your question i don't know <laughs> I don't mean to come off as, as rude or, or anything like that. Um, I don't know. A year ago, I was definitely charging less. But at, at this point, with, with the amount of time I've put into this business, I, I think I can justify a, a higher price. And so far, I've had, like zero complaints from customers everyone who's got a ring has has really enjoyed it i've i've got over a hundred five star reviews on etsy like oh well, that's good that's good like i've i've put a lot of work into this uh, a lot of people do this for a hobby or for fun this this is a, a real business for me man Which is pretty cool that I, like, get to do what I really enjoy. I, I hear you can get uh, tax breaks if you hire employees. I haven't gotten that far yet. I've been thinking about uh, going from a sole proprietorship to an LLC. And that kind of freaks me out. So I've been dragging my feet on it a little bit. That's probably my next big jump. Do the LLC? Yeah, I think so. I think it would be a good idea. See, I've got my name registered. 
Um, I get, like, bills from the county now, which is pretty, like, it's next level, man. Yeah, I mean, and it's fine silver, too. Like, if if you went to a jewelry store and, like, let me see if I've got one here. Like, this, this is a one-ounce fine silver ring. Like, it's not like a baby ring. Like, this thing is hardcore, right? It's, it's going to get noticed. It's got great detail on it. Very unique. And, like, you could easily pay $300 for, you know, a silver ring like this size at a jewelry store. Just saying. How much was the keychain? I believe it was 25. But that is a state quarter keychain with the skull and crossbones stamp on it. Uh, you can get just a state quarter keychain for 15. What I'm doing here is just polishing up this next order. I really like to have my stuff come out nice and shiny the last minute and a lot of this is done like purely by hand like I don't I don't use a lot of machinery or mechanics or electricity like it's it's done fast and it's done by hand and you get to watch it get done which is pretty cool right like it's, it's like dinner in a movie you know And these also get reposted on YouTube, so you can go back and watch them into perpetuity and see your ring get remade a thousand times if you want. If anybody else has any questions, go ahead and put them in the chat. This is a Rhode Island quarter corn ring. I've got these in all 50 states and in copper clad and 90% silver. Uh, goes up to size 13, down to size 4. my ring box y'all see that oh yeah there we go it's pretty cool yeah I've got New Jersey I've got all 50 states and that's another thing that like factors into the cost is like having to inventory the variety of coins I have uh, it takes a lot of time can you mail a coin say that it was your grandfather's and use it for a ring Yes. Uh, so custom orders cost exactly the same uh, for like the type of coin as if you ordered it off my website. So let's say that it's it's a 1964 quarter. Uh, that's going to be 90% silver. That'd be $100. Uh, if you want to do that, I have a button on my profile that says get a quote. Just tell me as much as you can about the coin, uh, what year it is, what kind of coin it is, what it's made of, and the ring size you need. And I can I can get you a quote, and that uh, it's I guess it's not really a button, but it's like red text. Just tap my logo right here, go to my profile, and it'll it'll say get a quote.
if anybody else has any questions, feel free to ask. I know this is kind of a, a slower uh, TikTok video, but I had to pack some stuff up and I wanted to test out the whiteboard, see how that goes. Uh, but I'll, I'll probably be making this into a ring. As soon as I finish packing these up. But I'm gonna do like a TikTok trick, right? Where I'm gonna I'm gonna end my live, and then I'm gonna come back in like four minutes, and it'll be like a bunch of new people. So that'll be cool. So yeah, if you guys want to watch me uh, make this into a ring, go ahead and hit the follow button. You should get like a notification when I go live again. Or just come back to my profile in like four or five minutes. And we'll be working on this. Alright, I'll see you then.